Hey everyone, my name is Karstadi and welcome back to SCP Containment Breach. So this is episode 2 and I wanted to get back into this game because one of you left a lovely, lovely comment on my last video. Thank you very much. Uh, also, welcome to the channel because you're new here. You basically gave me some advice in that, yes, you can save this game. You press F5, which I had no idea. Uh, so that's very helpful. <laughs> Thank you. And then you also told me that they're adding some updates and stuff to this game in a couple weeks. So that's very exciting. And you said to explore a lot while I can here. So that's just what I'm gonna do. Now today I wasn't really feeling like doing anything. I was kind of like, oh, this really sucks. I'm quarantined and I really am not supposed to. Like in California, they basically have already told people don't leave your houses. And it's like a legal thing that you're not allowed to leave your house. And that just happened to Illinois as well. I live in Wisconsin, so that's like slightly south of me. Um, and so if it's going that way, then I was... I mean, it is obviously going that way, because the whole situation sucks. Uh, but, you know what? I was like, the heck with the negativity. I'm going to make the best of it. Uh, so coronavirus can go lick a duck, as far as I care. Because I'm going to do something fun, and I'm going to do what I do. Hey, man! I'm going to do what I set out to do when I started this channel, which is entertain you guys and brighten your days, because... The whole situation just sucks. It's That's no joke. Um, but I'm going to use this actually to talk to you guys now. And hopefully you are watching this. If you're not watching the video, well, nothing I can do about that. But um, I'm just asking you guys to please take it seriously. Because it is a serious issue that needs to be addressed. And I can't talk with that in my ears. It is a serious issue, the coronavirus thing. So make sure you guys are taking the necessary precautions to prevent it. If it doesn't affect you and you have a strong immune system, then that doesn't change the fact that you can still carry it and transfer it to somebody who may not be as fortunate as you. And then that can be very unfortunate for them, or critical, I guess, is the word I'm looking for. Anyways, we're going to play SCP Containment Breach. Here we go. All right. I'm ready to get back into this game. Did it not save my brightness settings? No, it didn't. It didn't. No, it did. It did. It did. That's my grandma. I have a, we have a family health group chat uh, just to keep tabs on everybody. So it's probably not a bad idea. Like extended family. Obviously not people in this household, but like extended family. Oh yeah, it saved the settings. Cool. Light containment zone, sub level 02. Uh, I'm going to try saving. It works. If you press F5, it'll save your game. SCP-173. That's the guy. We gotta name him, actually, and I'm not really sure what to name him. What rhymes with 173? Billy. Silly. Silly's pretty good. Oh, okay. 173 document. I didn't see this before. I don't want to miss anything this time. So we're not going to do that. Containment protocol. SCP-173 is to be kept in a standard containment chamber constructed with reinforced concrete and sealed by a heavy blast door. Windows are to be installed 5 meters above the floor of its containment chamber, adjoined by an observation room with steel shutters in order to maintain eye contact with SCP-173 before and during testing. Description. Uh, SCP-173 is a concrete statue of unknown origin, measuring 2 meters tall and weighing approximately 468 kilograms. He's a statue? I had no idea it was a statue. I thought he was just like this weird creature thing. The statue is vaguely humanoid in shape, although improperly proportioned. Traces of Krylon brand spray paint on the statue's upper body resembling a face. Chemical analysis of the concrete shows no discernible abnormalities. When the statue is left unobserved and in line of... S and the line of sight is broken by a conscious being, the statue becomes animate, moving at speeds documented between 60 and 90 kilometers per hour. Holy crap. As blinking breaks visual contact, personnel assigned to enter its containment chamber are instructed to alert one another before blinking. Uh, we're going to skip to the next highlighted part. However, the statue is extremely hostile and will attempt to kill any human. Well, I... That's interesting. I had no idea he was a statue. So are these all, like, not actual creatures? They're just weird creations? Search. Please. Please. Thank you. Is there nothing? Do I have anything in my inventory? Bandage. Oh, I got you. So I grab stuff every time that happens. All right, let's see if uh, Silly Boy is in here. 
Silly Billy. That rhymes. Let's try Silly Billy. Oh. Well, I guess he is a statue. That's kind of cool. But also not. All right. That was great timing. That was great, fantastic timing. I'm going to save it here just to be safe. So for people who are watching right now and are like, what are you doing? I don't know lore about this game. I don't know the story. I don't know anything. I am new to the whole world of SCP. So maybe this was a good idea to play the game. Maybe it wasn't. I don't know. Who am I to say? So this is a room last time that Silly Billy was in. And uh, I wasn't able to explore much. So there's going to be stuff like first aid. Oh, okay. I got you. Uh, emergency press to call. Can I call anyone? That would make sense if I could. All right. We're going to go through here. Oh, I guess I can do that. That's pretty neat. Hello. Ooh, hey, guys. Hi. How's it going? Ooh, electrical panel. Wow. Electrical breaker. Sorry, my bad. What is that? Can we like kill Billy with it? That would be fantastic. That would be just fantastic. We can end all my suffering. Do I need all these medkits? I really don't know if I do or not. Nine of 12 items. Okay, I should really can, I should really not waste all these spots. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep three of them. Three is good, three is good. Oh, I will. That's cool. It's like Minecraft. All right, we're gonna close that. because I don't know my way around that room. So we're gonna go back this way. Cool, cool, cool. Cool beans, coolio, coolio. And we're gonna go through this door because we went through the other one before. Is he in here? Oh, hey there. That legitimately scared me, okay. Oh crap, I pushed the wrong button. I thought it was space for some reason that you press to uh, are those eyes. No, that's a circuit control panel or whatever you want to call it. I thought it was space to open the door, but I messed up. And so I blinked and then he was obviously right there as you saw. So that's pretty neat. That statue. Dangly bells. Now what is this? The game just lagged, so something's about to happen. Show yourself! I'm not afraid of you! I think... I don't think I'm afraid of you. SCP-1499. Safe. Was I in here before? I believe so. Again. Pushing the wrong button. Gosh darn it! Why? How do I get rid of this guy? It's the same jack wagon that I ran into last time, and I don't know how to get rid of him. Also, like, what is this? Warehouse has... Oh, yeah, this is the thing. Hey, bud. Just end my suffering now. That's fine. That's fine. I don't know how to get rid of you, so... If anybody knows anything about SCP-106, that would be great. I'm actually going to look him up real quick. SCP Foundation. Let's find some information on him. Is not exceptionally agile and will remain motionless for days at a time waiting to pray. How do I get rid of him? Well, I know what he does now, I guess. Do I know how to get rid of him? No. So at this point, I'm not even trying to like play the game and I don't know what anything about the story. So I just want to figure out stuff and figure out what the heck is going on. Because like, imagine that my character in the game just had their memory wiped, which is could be a possibility, I don't know. Um, and they have no idea what's going on or how they got there. Yeah, that's me in real life. I have no idea what's happening. But we're gonna see, we're gonna see what happens. So maybe I shouldn't go in there. Maybe, probably not. So we're gonna go back this way. Is silly boy, silly Billy in here? No, he's not. What's in? What is going on here? What is going on here? I don't know what I did. What I do? What 
Did I just lock myself in here? Phone's ringing. Grandma, is that you? Auxiliary ventilation online. Wait a minute. What did I do? 173531. We can figure out who is after me. All these SCP gates are unlocked. Also, I don't know what I did, but I'm gonna save it here. And you're probably screaming at me if that was a mistake. But it seems like a good thing. It just, it feels right, you know? You know, with the music, the good feeling music and everything that happened. It just felt right. So maybe it's like if I go in the wrong place, I don't want to go there. Um, then the 103 or whatever, the, whoever the heck just killed me last time. Then maybe he, that's when he tries to get me. What am I hearing? Oh, that sounds fine. That sounds just fine. Can I stop blinking now? Alright, we're just gonna go for it. Because I don't think Silly Billy is in here. I know for a fact he is not. Oh, bathrooms! I love the bathroom! Hoya! Show yourself! Gotcha! Wilson! Cool, alright. I like bathrooms. Bathrooms are fun. All you need is... You could literally live in a store. You wanna know why? Because they got bathrooms. And they got food. And all you need is bathrooms and food. Sorry, I'm... Slightly nervous here. Just slightly. There's nothing in here. Okay, never mind. I hate the bathroom. The, ha the, the bathroom sucks. Actually, it's quite charming. I am pleasantly surprised at how well kept these bathrooms are, given our current circumstances, you know. Did I just go backwards? Yeah, this is 173's. Isn't it? This is where I started! Actually, I'm gonna go upstairs as long as I'm here. We're going in big circles. Big circles. I thought I didn't do the circle thing, but apparently I did do the circle thing. Yeah, that's, that's not important. Is there something in here going on? Okay, refresh my memory, even though it was a few days ago, but... Dr. Fernheim, this is Cornelia. How oh. many people are still unaccounted for? Oh, I do not know. Everyone from the upper levels has been cleared, but only a few missing. We have lost the security and research teams here. Most of the people that are missing are from the lower levels. I am your father. I mean, Oh no. We have multiple accounts for SCP-106 and 173. We have only heard a single report for SCP-09. The yeah. Others, I'm not sure yet. I can attest to both of those. Yeah, but I don't know about the third one, because I don't know who that is. We haven't been properly introduced. That does not look appetizing in the slightest. Unless it's like one of those jello things or like some nice stew. I guess I can zoom in. I didn't even realize that. Site lockdown is in effect. Cafeteria menu option. SCP-294. Oh, this, this is new notification. So it's been five hours. Do I have a shelter area? That would be nice. That would be really nice. I forgot I can zoom, so that's important. I probably should have zoomed in on those things when I saw the thing. Oh, is this a big boy that I'm supposed to know about? I can't really see him. 3,000? Samuel? <laughs> Samuel? Samuel? Thamiel? Thamiel. Thamiel. Oh, I thought it was like Thamiel, like Samuel, but Thamiel. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, well, there's nothing of interest up there too much for me that I know of. <laughs> that interested me because that's that's what makes sense um and now we're gonna go back this way the way that we came you know for the second or third time that i've played this game hey what are you doing here i know this is your home and all but like get it together man Jeez louise 
Ouch. Maybe he'll just go away after a certain amount of time. Because I know if I walk by him, he's gonna do something funky. Which is exactly where I'm gonna walk by him. Bathroom. This is a bad idea. Hey. Ready? Oh, hey, bud. Hey, bud. Okay. Well, that was neat. Um, I think if I stay in this room too long, the 106 guy is gonna get me, so... We should not do that. Let's... Let's not do that. <laughs> Righteous. Did I go this way already? I can't even remember. I don't... Oh, yes, I did. That's the mark of me. That's my mark on the world. I don't want to go that way because we came from that way. So I want to go this way. Ah, yes, this is the place where the thing happened the one time. You remember that place where the thing happened? Yeah, that was that other place too. So, all right. This is new. This is very new. Can I open this? I want to get in there, but I think I need a key for starters, and I also need a key guard. That's right up here. Oh, oh, oh! Stairs! Guys, I found stairs! I found stairs! What the frick? Okay. I'm just gonna save it, then. Dip, dip, insert, swear word here that I can't say because PG channels. For the most. Actually, it's not even a PG channel because a lot of the content isn't PG, but... Grandma, stop talking to me! Oh! Ha! Sucks to be you! Sucks to suck! Oh, boy. You just suck the fun out of everything. Yep. Case in point. I don't even know where I am. Can I just save? Maybe this is gonna save with the monster guy there. I don't really know. How do I get rid of him? How do I get rid of this jerk? I died. Okay, let's load it real quick, and I'm gonna see if I just stayed there. I'm gonna see. We're gonna see with my big ol' eyes. He's not here. Good, 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 good. This is fantastic. I don't think there was any... I didn't, like, notice anything uh, remotely interesting on that one monitor, so I think we're gonna be okay. But I'm gonna go down here because this seems like a safe containment zone. Or whatever the heck you want to call it. God darn it! Ooh, why would you do that? Ooh. Well, that's all we got for this episode of SCP Containment Breach. Let me know what you thought. You specifically. Let me know what you thought. I want to know. I also need your help. Because <laughs> I don't know how to get rid of SCP-106 when it happens. Or how to avoid that from happening. It doesn't seem like there is a way to avoid it. But man, oh man, do I like this game. It seems, actually, I know this for a fact. It's like a very, very long game and you find more and more about what happened. There's really no progressive end to it. It's kind of, kind of along the lines of Amnesia, which I should probably keep playing because uh, a lot of people probably don't even know I did Amnesia because it was a while ago. So yeah, that's that. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like the video, consider commenting and liking. And also, if you're new here, I'd really, really, it warms my heart. It would warm my heart so much if you decided to subscribe because I really appreciate that. And like, I like doing this, so it, <laughs> it helps. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see all y'all in the next one. Stay frosty, folks. Bye.